this is class 5 social studies continuation of lesson 2 maps in a previous class we have learned what is a map and different types of maps today we will discuss elements of map map consists of different elements some of them are directions scale colors symbols uh, directions there are four main directions those are north east west and south if we stand facing a map the top part of the map is north bottom is south right is east and left is west direction na kun north east west south ko min atung lang map ko even na hile atung lang kun north ahi in anoi lang ko south ahi in right lang ko east ahi in to a left lang ko west ahi in north to east ki ka hun north east au min north between north and east lies north east north and west lies between north and west lies north west south east between south and east lies south south east between south and west lies south west north to east ki ka hin north east au min south to east ki ka in south east au min north west ki north to west ki ka in north west au min to ting le south to west ki ka in south west au min hi now jilaya red mark nga ki bol red point ki bol not not mo na ko idin ting la hin kui laya ki umham ti chu east west south mun hi aki hathe zin ahi the scale of a map is the ratio between distances shown on a map to the actual distance on the ground for example the actual distance between two cities may be 100 kilometers but on a map it may be shown as one kil one centimeter then the scale of the map is one centimeter equal to 100 kilometer scale hi iti ting la hin iten na gam iten now city apa city khat hi lo le ko apa ko khat chu hung ki te the lo ding hung hi ting la khun example la chun 100 kilometers ko khat na apa ko khat chu 100 kilometers hung hi ting la hin ki la hi in te ding ting la hin scale la khun one centimeter hung hi in hi chu 100 kilometers hi ahin te bai na ding a chu scale la one centimeter ko ki la hi in Mm, five centimeter, for example, five centimeter equal to five hundred kilometer. Fifty kilometers is equal to half centimeter. This is called linear scale. Next slide. Colors. Colors. Certain different colors are used in maps, showing oceans, seas, mountain, plains, deserts, etc. Mm, colors. Ahin. Um. Uh. Color. Chum chum in. Ocean ho hiin, sea ho hiin, mountain ho hiin, plain, desert ho hiin, color chum chit hong ki musa in. Ta chit in vet na hi le, water bodies, tui la ho chu. Water bodies are always shown in blue, water body ho chu, blue in aki mu in. Chu ting le, mountains and highlands are shown in brown and yellow. Mountain ho, highlands la ho chu, brown ahi lo le, yellow color in aki musa in. Plains and lowlands are shown in green. Plains la ho, lowlands la ho chu, amun name la ho chu, green color in, aki musa in ahi. Next slide, symbols. To make it easier to show features and places on a map, certain standard symbols are used in maps. Symbol, hong kiti ting la hin. Iyong namun ho, hi, alim da na hong ki sim thay lo hi te, hi zi atun, symbol in hong ki ko in. Symbols in aki ko in, so ting la, a symbol is a sign or symbol, Shape that is used to represent something. Tilaya vet sa natun. It is shown on the screen. Um, railway line, roads, boundary, river, well tank, temple, church, post office, settlement, graveyard, trees, grass. Tilaya symbol screen na kivet sa abang natun. Oh, mean. For example, um, to show a church on a map, we can just put a cross at that spot instead of writing the word church there. How uh, in bang to? Church dia isut sangu bacaun cross limi ikoi ya hilai hilai muncu ho in mun heti kehat sana hein. Once we are familiar with with these symbols, we are we can understand a map easier. Itulah ya symbol ho in head to ting lecun. For example, post office to PO kisunin, post and telegraph PTO kisunin. Itu ho in head heh tak ting lecun map sa tu symbols hehui lah ya tu 
ho in mun uma ho lai post office umam ti su ke the he now my dear children you have learned elements of a map their directions scale colors and symbols now for your assignment a fill in the blanks number 1 and atlas is a book of maps number 2 The ratio of distance on a map to actual distance is known as the scale of the map. Number three, on a map, high mountains shown in water bodies. Number five, on a map, the use of the color blue shows symbols. Number six, on a map drawn to a scale of one centimeter, hundred kilometers, a distance of the centimeters on the map means an actual distance of five hundred kilometer. Number seven. If north is at the top in a map, west is to the left. Number B, match the columns. Arrow mark and on map is to see north. Number two, one centimeter, one kilometer. D, map scale. Plains. Number three, plains, green in color. Number four, dash dot. This symbol is to boundary between two countries. Five. This symbol. is to map skill now for your assignment five uh, five bridge uh, five these symbols is equal to b bridge uh now c question and answer three how is direction usually shown in maps answer maps are usually drawn with an arrow mark and at the top to in- indicate north this helps us to find south east and west number four what do you understand the term scale of a map The scale of a map is the ratio between the distance shown on a map and the actual distance on the ground. Five. Which standard colors are used in maps? Answer. The standard colors used in maps are blue. It shows water bodies. Brown. It shows mountains and hills. Yellow. It shows plateaus and highlands. Green. It shows plains and lowlands. Six. What are symbols? A symbol is a shape or sign that is used to represent something. Uh, for your assignment, multiple choice questions. Phase 16.